this Twitch deal that I have might be my last big streaming contract that I'm willing to take on. It's low for my YouTube. It's not that low. I think like what 200k average after not posting for seven months is expected. I'm not too worried about it. Chat, if I'm not worried about it, you definitely should not be worried about it. When I first started posting Among Us video, each of those videos got like 150,000 for the first month. And then they just started hitting 2 million each. Like YouTube, there is the algorithm, but it comes and goes. Like if you get too hung up on trying to make every video pop off, then you're going to give yourself a lot of anxiety. Uh, what I've come to accept with streaming and YouTubing is you're never going to have your peak numbers all the time, right? And you can't really force meta. Like you can't really force things to happen as a streamer. I've tried and I was a fool to think I could. I had to learn a lot of lessons like trying to force like Minecraft server or like Rust servers or big collapse here, big collapse there, trying to catch that magic, but It's going to come again. It's going to go again. And another Among Us will show up one day. The only thing we have to concern ourselves with is being relevant enough to be able to uh, capitalize on that when it does happen, right? I don't see myself streaming long term anymore. I see myself doing it for fun. But this Twitch deal that I have might be my last big streaming contract that I'm willing to take on. Uh, I'll still stream because I, I like streaming and I think streaming is such a unique form of entertainment, right? There's nothing quite like streaming. And it's grown so big over the last couple of years. But, you know, people eventually want to try new things. I would love to be um, a writer or a producer for, like, a TV show or a movie. I also thought about retiring and just traveling the world and vlogging my life with my, uh, hopefully, existing girlfriend. Because traveling the world by yourself is kind of lonely. And we would just travel and vlog. And hopefully I'm interesting enough for people to keep tuning in. There's not a lot of great games. You, you'll hear every streamer complain about this. There's no good game right now. And yeah, it's, that's the truth. I'm lucky because I've been off Twitch for so long and coming back on Twitch, everything is so new. It's like, wow, GTRP, Valorant, League of Legends. Uh, but for most people who's been on Twitch for a while now, it's probably day in, day out. So us, why not just get a girlfriend? I want you to be happy. Yeah, let me let me just go get one. Fuck! What did I think about that? Also, chat, you need to learn to be able to live by yourself. You know, just because you're alone doesn't mean you're lonely. If you don't accept yourself, how can you ex expect someone else to accept you? You need to be responsible for your own happiness first. And then, and then, you can start looking for a significant other. 
if you rely on someone else like being your happiness that's a lot of pressure right it's 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 a lot of pressure to be responsible for someone else's happiness Toast, I thought you were dating Pokey. We broke up. That was really hard. But I couldn't just... I, I just couldn't accept the fact that her ass was bigger than mine. It was My ego was too bruised. <laughs> 